Have you ever wondered why most people struggle to earn more money, in spite they work very, very hard, in spite they actually want to earn more money, but they don't seem to know how? Money seems to be a subject that they don't understand. Well, simply because money was not taught in school. I used to struggle with money as well until I learned some of the principles that I'll be sharing with you in this particular video. Now, money earned is a byproduct of value creation. Now, I'm not talking about the people who make money illegally or unethically. I'm talking about commerce in the business world, how most people earn money, either making a living or selling something or providing a product or service to society. So if money earned is a byproduct of value creation, what it means is the more value you deliver, the more people you deliver value to, guess what? The more money you make. You see, money doesn't go to the people who need it the most. In fact, money doesn't care. Money is neutral. Money goes to people who knows how to multiply. Money goes to people who knows how to add value. So here are five simple moves that you can make today to earn more money. Simple money move number one, add value to things. Add value to things. Let me give an example. Let's say you invest in a property. You just bought a property. Ask yourself the questions. What are some of the things that you could do to add value to that property? Maybe you will renovate the kitchen. Maybe you will renovate the bathroom. Maybe you will add an extra room. Maybe you turn that basement into a suite. Maybe you put some new paint or new carpet. What are some of the things that you can do to add value to the property? So if we're thinking about adding value, increasing the value of the property, what happens now? You can get more rent. Or if you want to flip the property, you want to sell it in the future, now you can get more money. And that's how money is earned. Let me give you another example. Can you add value to your product or service? Example, you're selling a product. Can you add a stronger guarantee? Can you add some bonuses that are not available anywhere else? What about if you are selling a service? What are some of the add-on services that you could add on to what you do without costing you a lot of money, yet at the same time has a high perceived value to your clients? So simple money move number one, add value to things. Simple money move number two, add value to the process. Think about middle management or even upper management. What do they actually do besides mapping out the strategies? What they're actually doing most of the time for an organization is adding value to the process. They're looking at different processes within a company. It could be a hiring process. It could be a buying process. It could be an operation process. Whatever processes that they are using to run the business, they're looking for ways to add value. They're looking for ways to improve that. Let's say if you have a job and you're working for a company right now, and most people at a lower level, they are only doing what they're supposed to do. They're only doing, well, this is what it is. I'm just getting my job done. Instead of thinking about how can I add value to the process? How could we make this more efficient? How could we make this more effective? How could I actually produce better results with less input? See, these are very different set of questions versus, oh, I guess I'll just do this and, and do the very minimum. Most people do so little, they just do the bare minimum. They just do enough not to get fired. What do you think of a person who only does the bare minimum? That's not what you want to do if you want to earn more money. You want to add value to the process. Simple money move number three, add value to sales and marketing. Now, sales and marketing, they are revenue producing activities within the organization. It doesn't matter what you do. Again, it doesn't matter if you have a job or if you are a business owner. If you look at your sales and marketing, how could you add value to what you're doing? Example, if you are closing right now, if you are in sales, and let's say your closing percentage is one out of 10. So for every 10 prospects you talk to, you close one. That's okay. But what if you could improve the way that you do that? What if you can close a higher percentage? Let's say instead of closing one out of 10, you're closing two out of 10. So not 10%, but instead you're closing 20%. What happens to income? You've just doubled your income because you're adding value to sales and marketing. And let's say you have a funnel, you have a sales page, you have a website, and it is converting at a certain percentage. But by adding value to marketing, you're figuring out maybe you could improve the headline, you're adding value to the headline, or maybe you make some simple tweaks on just the page itself on the design. And now you're converting more clicks to leads and from more leads 
to sales. All you're doing is adding value to sales and marketing. If you have a sales team by training them, by equipping them with better skills, better follow-up scripts, you're adding value to sales and marketing. And that's what sales manager does. That's what a marketing director would do or VP of marketing would do. Adding value to sales and marketing. Simple money move number four, add value to people. Your network is your net worth. What does that mean? It means you have a network of like-minded people. You have a list of contacts. You have a network that you could tap into whenever you need help. A network that trusts you, that likes you, that supports you, that could give you assistance and advice and help when you need it. Now, how do you build a network? What if you are starting from scratch? I hear this a lot on social media. Oh, but, but then how, how do I get started? How do I build a network? I don't have any contacts. Guess what? Contact is not something that you have. Contact is something that you go get. And the only way you'll get contact is by adding value to people. You're adding value to people's lives. You're adding value to your network before you ask anything in return. But then I don't have any value to add to these people's lives. That's the problem, isn't it? You don't have any value that you could add on. You don't have any value that you could bring to the table. If you want to build your network, you need to invest in it, meaning that you need to help them. You need to offer any sort of help that you could, make that referrals. That's how trust is built. So think about how you could add value to the people around you in your network. You want to dig your well before you are thirsty. Simple money move number five, and it is the most important one, and that is adding value to yourself. What do I mean by adding value to yourself? I'm talking about acquiring new knowledge. I'm talking about reading that book. I'm talking about listening to that podcast. I'm talking about getting trained. I'm talking about seeking mentors. I'm talking about leveling up your mindset and your skill set. Maybe it is taking a program or joining Toastmasters, improving your communication skill. Maybe it's joining a class that would teach you how to communicate better, how to communicate with confidence. Maybe it's learning social media, learning technology, so you could market yourself, your personal brand, your product or your service better. Maybe it's working out so you could have more energy, or maybe it's making some adjustments, making some changes within your diet so you would feel better about yourself, you feel better about your body. If you want to improve your ability to add value to the marketplace, if you want to improve your earning capabilities, check out danlockshop.com. We have a lot of proven resources that could help you earn more and be more. Hi, this is Dan Lock. We're looking to invest $10 million in 100 tech startups in the next three years. You could be one of them. If you are a founder of a tech startup, if you are looking for financial capital, guidance, and mentorship, go to www.danlockventures.com to see if you qualify.